You can't keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bare hands! You gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> you shit <coughs> fucking bastards! <coughs> Open this door, goddammit! <coughs> I will knock the we goddamn door stop. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet- Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Let us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! This goddamn thumbsucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walkers! Don't Dad, give up. Please. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down! Oh, I'll rip your goddamn heads off and make you swallow them! Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah. I want to attract their attention, so I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Come on, show yourself. Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! There's more of us on the way! Let us out now. It got caught you and duck, Lee. Those fuckers have my family. I know. We're gonna get out of here and find them. They're not gonna open the door. You, you think a fucking Could there be a hole behind these the pallets? Right chop people into meat. No such luck. Dad, this isn't healthy. Shelves are pretty sturdy. We could climb up, uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! If he's dead... He's not dead! What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six-foot-four, three-hundred-pound, seriously pissed-off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. You gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee, I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee, I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting what? all of us at risk, you son of a bitch! Three! You're fucking worthless, Four. Lee. Five. No! <laughs> Kenny, I'm so, what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... 
It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! <laughs> Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know, I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I'm sorry, Lily. He was still lively. He was still alive. You've got to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. <laughs> I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. Look, if we're gonna survive this shit, we've got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. Talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Dust? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have- No! They, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him, that's all. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is there's safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. It's not coming off that way. Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for him, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, any 
idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. screws and get this unit off. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. our way out, Lee. We don't know where it leads. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I, I can find out. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. slaughterhouse. with these people. Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. Jesus, this is where they butcher people. Sick bastards. All of them. you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any.
Dad, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh, shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Well, quit sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep alive? Not the kid. There's enough meat on the trail. Oh, I know, Mabel. This is my favorite part, too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Lee, focus. Where's Danny? Understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Get part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Mark never volunteered to be food. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't. Go. I'll keep Clementine safe. Way too long. They attacked us! I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. Don't go, Lee. No, no! Get shut up, and you'll be fine. Oh, no. I'm a 
take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Set her down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? We're Katja and the kid. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there! I mean it. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. No, uh-uh, you did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe.
Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Let's go. 